South Africa, mostly is, almost everything I see is comes made in China, clothing, electronics, and nowadays we've got cars made in China. So I also like wanted to see what is really China all about. Why is it making everything? Okay, the people in China they're very different. They're very friendly people. I've never thought about them like this. Um, and as much as they, it's just the big population and uh, they're very good at what they do and uh, I love most of their food they're more African as well they just cook them differently but I enjoy them and I enjoy the environment of China my favorite doing in Beijing so far it's shopping go to the markets and yeah I get the best things yeah I visited um, Forbidden City I visited uh, Mutong uh, and the markets, the silk markets, the Yashu markets. So far that I'm using, I'm always using the subway. Okay, uh, the subway is very, very cheap, very cheap, extremely cheap. It's it's convenient. Uh, the only uh, difficult part is when you're using a taxi to town because there's always a traffic and the taxi is quite expensive. Internship is actually, uh, for me, it's an uh, on-job training. Um, it's actually giving you an exposure of uh, your your career of uh, like if you, like myself I'm in the mechanical designing so I've never designed before I only did the theory part of it so for me it was a really good opportunity to get an intern before I can get a, a job after that. so but it's actually um, a step ahead for me to get experience in my field. So far, because like I said, I only did the theory part of designing and I did the engineering drawing. So I've never used the software to design. So, so far I've, I did the basics with, through the pro engineering and the CAD drawings. I've now I can be able to, to, to design. They can give me a, a, a sketch, a drawing or a picture. I can design according to what they want through the pro engineering. So it's, actually a good experience that I've gained so far in the f this few two weeks so I'm looking forward for more so this company is actually uh, designing the, the shell of the machines so the big machines, the CNC machines, the milling machines so what we do, we, we get the, the drawings in CAD and the pictures from the different factories so as, as we, 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 what we do is we, we design the mold the mold of the machine then our senior designers the experienced one most experienced one day the one that designed the shell of the machine according to the mold that we we've designed so yes that's basically that we do as intent so far okay the, the work environment it's good it's quite good it's totally different to 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 the, the the environment that i was working at so it's it's quite good i'm enjoying I'm, I'm comfortable, no, no problems here yeah, and the people around the environment, it's just, it's good. Okay, working in my own country, I was a mechanical technician, so I used to do more of the physical work. I was actually going to work with overalls and getting dirty and all those things. I was going underground, under mine. I used to work in the, the plant where there is extremely um, high risks, exposed to high risks. So in this department, I'm, I'm office based, I'm always in the office and um, I'm doing more of the critical and challenging work. So um, in my environment, I, I, they only tell me, okay, you can go and do this, go and do this and that. So me now in this environment, I have to design what people they're going to use in the future. So that's the difference and I love the challenge. Like I said, I mentioned the Chinese people, they're very friendly people. So. Yes, they, they, they are very helpful, though they, the, the problem is just the language, but we're using your DAO to, 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 to translate. Like, they, they try by all means to, to help me out, to, so that they, they can teach me how they design. So my colleagues, they are very helpful, they helping me with everything. I was applying for jobs, so um, I got to, um, came across the, the agency, get into China. I went through to their website. I left my email that I'm looking for an intern and everything, and I left all my details there. And uh, one of your consultants uh, uh, 
by name of Paul Dodds called me. He um, he asked for my uh, my requirements and my CV. I sent it through to him. He interviewed me through Skype and that's how easy it was for me. Then he told me all the procedures I should follow. Then I did that. Um, it was very helpful and it had all the information that I am um, I, I needed. Like I had options to choose from if I were going to be an international intern or I just wanted an internship only those kind of things. So they they put them in uh, in more detail. So that's when I chose mine because I had my own reasons why I choose to be an intern only. They don't have to pay for my uh, accommodation and stuff. So yeah, they have put everything there that you need. I don't think it was going to be possible in any case because the companies in China I cannot find them on like on website in their careers and like MS Design I wouldn't know about it if ever it was in about GI2C. I did research for the companies in China but I didn't find any. So I don't think I think without GITC I wouldn't have made it. So GIT is the only so far as I know is the only unless there is other agencies but uh, so far as I know without GITC I wouldn't have been here. The support it was very great. Um, first of all, they, they started with the orientation, and they orientated us. They told us about the culture of uh, China, how does the money works in China, how those kind of things, and we should look at them. And then yes, they took us to a um, less one hour lesson of Chinese classes. That's where I took uh, uh, their business card so that I can be able to do my lessons as well that I will be studying maybe next week. So yes, they, I love that about the orientation and they checking us, how is the internship, any problems. So yeah, that's what I love about JITC. They didn't just say, okay, now you're in China, then you don't care. So yeah, they supporting us, giving us the support that we need. Uh, no, not at this point, no. <laughs> No interesting stories. No, the interesting stories that I've came across, oh man, it's just okay. I'm I'm actually a, a business-minded person, so I've seen a lot of things that I can take from here to home to, to to actually make a living out of it. So yeah, um, that's that's the experience so far I've got through here. Yeah.